Yo, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. And today we have another Andorra career mode episode. And in this episode, we have a lot of matches to get through. We are going to play the matches of December and January and the January transfer window. I don't think we're going to be doing much transfer wise, but who knows? I said that last time and we ended up making three signings. So I'm excited. I hope you guys are too. With that being said, let's get straight into the episode. All right, to start off the episode, we're going to be playing the highlights against Cuesca at home. We have a lot of matches to get through so we're obviously gonna be playing the highlights of a few of them we're gonna sim some and we're gonna be playing some a big match all the normal starters are in as we fight to climb the table in la liga 2 so let's see let's see if andorra can pick up this massive three points all right it's a play for huesca now uh oh huesca trying to play through bumpin trying to catch it up yes bumpin what a tackle come on nice pizza we're gonna get the counter here. Arroyo gets it over to Marsa out wide to Pampin. Let's go, Pampin. No, Betsa. Companies. Pampin, no. The pass was too strong, man. Come on. Arroyo, I need you to stop this here. And he does just that. No. But they fall onto the rebound. Pampin, don't even. Yep, just cover that cross. Nice, he get her. They're gonna let us counter. Out to Garrido. Albanese. Nice. That's a foul, ref. Ah, and the ref blows his whistle. Nil, nil. In this first match, very, very tough start. All right, and a quick scout report from our youth academy scout in Spain. Nothing too crazy. Enrique Ledesma looks decent, but I don't, I don't think he's all that. His value is somewhat high. I think we'll leave him for another month and see how, how this report goes on. All right, second match. We're up against Aibar Array away from home a massive team here a former la liga side so this is gonna be very difficult to pick up the three points and we're also playing the highlights as you can see so let's see let's see if things can go our way as we start off with lobete getting to that free kick they're still in possession though stoikov uh casado who's in for this match nice defensive win there Bautista. oh arroyo misses the tackle Iker Alba is coming out what a save from Iker! all right Corpas and Marsa. Marsa misses a tackle. Oh, and Mario Soriano manages to make it 1 0 in this match. And it's going to jump to the 60th minute. A penalty for Eibar. Iker Alvarez saves. On Lobete. Plays it over to Iker. Benito takes a touch, takes a shot on the rebound. No. And ref blows his whistle full time. And it's a 1-0 win to Abad. A very difficult match for us. I wanted to walk away with at least a draw, but not going to be possible. All right, a huge match coming up. We're up against Espanyol. Pretty much a derby here as Gerard Piquet's hatred for Espanyol is going to fuel us in this match. We have to pick up these three points for the president. Erika kicks off. La Liga 2 action underway. And like I said, a must win match here. Not because we're trying to climb the table, but the president's hate straight for espanol being an ex barcelona legend is fueling us for this match oh, but Emil, as i say that espanol go up one nil and we we just aren't clicking defensively right now come on that's a foul ref come on be for real give him a yellow card what are you waiting for alex calvo in the box no carica get the shot off man no espanol are through Arroyo, nice. Iker Alvarez with the save. Marisa trying to clear it. On the rebound, Iker again. A big double save from our Andorran goalkeeper. Uh, and the ref's not going to let us play on. He blows his whistle. Halftime. We're down 1 0 to Espanol in this match so far. All right, second half underway and one change for this match. Bover is coming off for Marcasado. Bover is just very sluggish in the midfield this game. Not sure what's going on with him. Uh, Pampin gets beat there. Marisa looking to back him up. And he does so nicely. Casado. Over Albanese. Carica. Plays Albanese. Who's onside. Take it all the way, son. Albanese. Beach one. Takes a shot. What a save by the keeper. Alex Calvo wins it back. Carica. Mar Casado. Alex Garrido. He's through. With the shot! No! Just wide of the keeper. Oh, come on. Marisa gets beat. 
and they make it 2-0 what a bad match this was we're getting all the former la liga sides in this this episode so of course there's just no no hope of us winning these matches really all right full time ref blows his whistle 2-0 loss and andorra are just it's not it right now okay, so we take a heavy loss to league leaders espanol we also lose against abad who are in third place up next we're up against racing club or an eighth all these top 10 sides are, are just farming points off us man i'm not sure what to do and before our next match we have a lot of players who are running down their contracts so i'm gonna go through real quick give everybody their offers and decide who stays and who goes okay we gave everybody their offers the only one i'm not sure about is anderson arroyo in real life he moved away from andorra so that's the only reason why i'm thinking i'm not renewing him but i'm thinking about renewing him and then selling him in the summer actually yeah let's give him an offer we're gonna do that and then for the rest of them lobete i definitely want to bring back he's here on loan from celta carica also we'll see how he does think about bringing him back benito as well all these long players um i'm enjoying so i don't know we'll see we'll see if we can end up bringing them back or not all right and we're gonna go straight into this match against racing santander we're playing the highlights and a very rotated squad that we're using for this match so hopefully we can gain some type of momentum here we've had a rough start but santander get a shot off a very poor one another racing opportunity here it's marza yep just, just block that lane nebula with the shot, Icaralba is with the save. Alende, get that out. Yes, sir. Free kick for Andorra. We're gonna play it short. Alende plays Pablo Moreno. Moreno gonna reset. Play Pastor. Molina. And for Lobete. Lobete. Moreno. Yes, let's go. And just like that, Andorra is up 1 0 in the 33rd minute. Pablo Moreno getting his goal. Ver. Whips in the corner. Pastor, let's go! Yes, sir. 2 0 in the 41st minute. Let's go, man. An attack for Racing Santander. Now they go out wide with Ambula. Inigo. Rania. Come on. Ambula played through. Off the post. Come on. Molina. Jandro. Out wide. To Iker Benito. Iker Benito. Pablo Moreno. Pastor. Oh, I tried to play Iker. Come on. Oh, it's a clear chance here. Albanese. And <laughs> he shoots it wide. Oh my gosh. But the ref's going to blow his whistle. Full time. 2 0 win for Andorra. Let's go, man. A massive three points. We needed this momentum shift here. All right, we get a report from France. And nothing. Absolutely nothing that we can call up. Kind of disappointing, to be honest. All right. And our first match in the Copa del Rey. I'm going to be honest. A Copa del Rey run does sound appealing to me. But I'm going to sim this match. It is what it is. Whatever happens, happens. I want to focus solely on making a comeback in La Liga. So, let's see. Let's sim this match. And let's see what type of result we can get. All right. And full time. And we pick up a 1-0 win. We move on the Copa del Rey. Thanks to Karika Buru. You'd love to see it. We absolutely dominated this match too. So, hopefully this leads to a momentum shift in our season. And we just start stringing wins together bro what and as the transfer window opens up real celta vigo call back julian lobete why he was getting playing time oh no this is bad boys before we do anything before we most likely sim this match before we do this lobete i said in the january transfer window we were gonna do a massive youth academy call up and we're gonna do just that right now maybe this is the the wind of change that we need mamadou johnson promoted to the first team Santi Barrios promoted to the first team Nacho Aguirre promoted to the first team and Mael Simon promoted to the first team four players coming up a striker a left wing a right wing and a cam let's see if they can add any type of dynamic to the first team i'll be honest now with uh all these players getting called up we may not need Lobete back i don't know I'm kind of uh, kind of hopeful with these players, you know? They all look pretty good. All right, another Copa del Rey match. We're going to sim this. So let's see what type of result we can get. All right, and this match ends up going to penalties. 120 minutes of football. It goes to penalties after, and we go through 4-2 on pens. I don't even know what to say, to be honest. Let's just move on. <laughs> 
congrats we're through to the round of 16 that's incredible man all right and due to something coming up just now this is gonna be the final match of the episode up against leganes another former la liga team we're gonna be playing at home but i really really wanted to finish this month up but we gotta call this the final episode here i do sincerely apologize so let's see if we can end it on a win all right Andorra kick off, La Liga 2 action underway. And let's see if we can continue our small, small run of form that we've had in the Copa del Rey. Let's see if we can shift it over to La Liga 2 by being nice with Aleix Garrido. Aleix running out wide. Come on, Carica. Get open. Run to the far post. Run to the far post. Come on, dude. Bro, we're the lowest scoring team in the league. That's insane, bro. That is insane. We got to do something about that. We got to flip the switch. Come on. He could have saved. Might as well get that out. Garrido out wide. Albanese back to Garrido. Carica. Plays that up for Albanese. Can he beat Niam to it? The veteran Niam. We just can't do anything, man. Oh, come on. What a lasso out of nowhere, too. He just had, he saw that small glimpse of space and took it at halftime. <laughs> oh, man. It is very demoralizing to conceive like that. It's even more demoralizing that the team just doesn't react. I don't know. I don't know what to do, boys. We're bringing on the, the Youth Academy graduates. Let's see if the Youth Academy prospects can cause havoc. Arroyo pushing out wide. Nice, Arroyo. Way to stay with them. That's our throw in. I'm gonna do Johnson pressuring. Nice! Johnson. No, nobody's there. Nice. You could have been Ito. Plays Mamadou Johnson. Johnson for Aguirre. No, the defense is on it. Leganes. Oh, Leganes is through. Leganes. What a save by Iker. Come on. Oh! Simon played through. Simon, yes! Let's go! Let's go! The Youth Academy prospects pull the draw for us. Oh, boys. Let's freaking go, man. Oh, my gosh. Aguirre plays the pass through. Mael Simon curls it around the keeper and has a new era been born in Andorra. Full time, and it's 1-1. One, one. All right, what a way to end the episode. A late draw against Leganes we're still in 20th place with 20 points that is horrible but we're 16 points off a playoff position I don't know boys we're gonna have to turn stuff around hopefully the youth academy prospects can cause a reaction in the team so I don't know we'll call the episode here I appreciate y'all for watching and hanging through this tough run of form it really does mean the world to me. We're fighting every episode to get into form. It's, just, it's a poor team, man. It's, we got to build this team up. I appreciate y'all. Leave a like on the episode if you haven't already. Smash that subscribe button. Let's grow the channel together. I appreciate y'all so much. I don't know how many times I can say it. And with that, everybody stay safe, stay happy, stay healthy. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.